Hello everyone. It is not difficult for us to encounter drivers with poor driving skills on the road, making it very easy for us to experience road rage. So in this video, let's see the consequences and how to handle road rage if you are unlucky enough to be the main characters. Joey Roo was moving on the road when suddenly a Honda car sped up and encroached on the lane. The accident occurred unexpectedly, causing both vehicles to be damaged. The man and his wife both tried to shout and blame Joey, but the police confirmed that they were the ones at fault and needed to take responsibility. Road rage broke out between the cyclist and the driver of the truck. The rage seemed to end when the cyclist left, but the man driving the car suddenly rushed forward, intending to attack the cyclist. However, he immediately regretted it after taking a direct punch from the cyclist, collapsing to the ground. This delivery guy had to receive many fines for inciting causing accidents. The incident occurred between the young delivery man and the man driving the yellow car. Tensions escalated when the delivery man broke the yellow car's mirror and left. The yellow car immediately gave chase, but because the speed was too fast, the yellow car hit the railing really hard. The driver of the yellow car was injured, but fortunately, he is okay. This aggressive young man got out of his car, carrying a whip intending to hit someone. But was immediately sprayed in the face with pepper spray. The sedan driver suddenly stopped in the middle of the highway where there was no room for delay. This caused the trucks behind him to get angry and pull up and teach him a lesson. Do you agree with the behavior of these drivers? Let's discuss with the comments section. The incident happened on the highway when the man driving the motorbike rushed forward and brake check with the car behind. This made the man behind him angry, so he accelerated and crashed into the back of the motorbike. The impact was quite strong, causing the motorbike to lose control and take off. Unsurprisingly, the man riding the motorbike was injured, but fortunately he is fine. But this video continues to serve as a testament to the unpredictable consequences of rage. So hopefully you will always keep yourself calm when encountering any incident. This time, the rage came from a sedan with a tractor trailer, when the sedan pulled up and continuously brake checked the tractor behind. In the end, because of too many times like that, the man on the tractor became angry and accelerated, rushing straight into the sedan, causing the car's window to break. <laughs> Fajnie, teraz to się kurwa nagrą. Brawo, mam wszystko nagrane. Ja też mam nagrane. Tak, tak hamowałeś mnie. Na podwójnej ciągłej chciałeś to zrobić. Rage will never bring you home safely. The man driving the white car tried to force the man driving the bicycle to the side of the road in his rage. This caused the bike to almost fall. This escalated the anger, and the man driving the white car regretted his actions. Winz's security camera captured a road rage incident between a pickup truck driver and an SUV. The man driving a pickup truck blocked the SUV while waiting at a red light. 
The SUV driver decided to leave amid the rage of the man driving the pickup truck, and immediately the police were there and quelled his rage. A man in a white shirt, enraged, rushed to attack the truck driver, believing the truck driver had endangered him. However, when the truck driver got out with a baseball bat, the man quickly fled. Police quickly caught the woman and was later arrested after running away. Police at 137 miles per hour had run out of gas. This woman was driving to the intersection when a Jaguar suddenly cut across her path. What the f Leaving her extremely panicked by this reckless driving behavior. Both stopped and waited for the police to arrive and handle the situation. This is why you should drive slowly when everyone shows signs of stopping. Possibly due to a blind spot, this Toyota rushed in and hit the driver as he was trying to change lanes. Aces was moving in the dark on his way home, although he changed lanes very slowly and even stopped. A Toyota Sienna suddenly rushed in and hit the front windshield of his car hard, causing significant damage to the front of his car. The other driver left immediately after. Oh, wow, that guy went right through a red light. Crash in Washington when a Toyota tried to run a red light. Both cars crashed into each other in everyone's surprise. No one was injured, but both cars were seriously damaged. Perhaps honking is the best way to provoke anger. You're not looking. Be calm, okay? Jeez. The Lexus veered off the road when an SUV suddenly swerved into his lane. Both drivers were unaware of their surroundings and lost control of their vehicles. The Lexus spun around before coming to a stop. The driver of this Civic abruptly braked upon noticing another car changing lanes, forcing Marcus Lai's car to also brake hard to avoid a collision. However, the Kia behind was not so lucky. The collision was minor and did not result in any injuries. Five seconds of red light had passed, but the driver of this Lexus still tried to pass. He rushed forward and crashed head-on into the oncoming Volkswagen, causing the driver of the Volkswagen not to have enough time to handle this high-speed collision. The blue car was new, bought three months ago, and was considered completely damaged. After being stabbed and pulled away, the collision was very strong. This Honda CRV didn't want to miss the exit, so it accelerated and changed lanes. He didn't even bother turning on the signal lights and drove quickly, then crashed into an oncoming Hyundai. The SUV sped away and lost control, causing the car to almost flip over. Luckily, after the panic, the car returned to normal and everyone was safe. Two young men in a black sports car accelerated on a stretch of road between a high-speed train and a collector. They thought their lane would continue as the fourth lane on the collector. Unfortunately, the yellow line had been repainted on the asphalt, and a car had broken down under the bridge and had to stop halfway in the outermost left lane. The black car used its brakes fully, 
causing it to spin around before stopping, shocking everyone. But no one was injured. This time, the impatient Fortuner driver honked and overtook without any signal lights, only for his haste to backfire, not helping him get home any sooner. After all, a phone might navigate you anywhere you want, but it can't teach you how to drive safely. This incident occurred at the intersection of Alma School Road and Willis Road, Chandler, Arizona. The SUV driver intentionally ran a red light and crashed directly into an oncoming grey sedan. Both cars were damaged in the severe collision. Hopefully, everyone was safe. What do you think the driver of this van is doing in the car right now? Comment number one if you think he's dozing off, and comment number two if you believe the phone is distracting him. Kyle Davis was driving on the highway when he encountered an SUV traveling in the opposite direction and nearly hit the truck in front. Maybe this driver was distracted or sleepy, so he walked in the middle of the median and almost crashed straight into the car in front. The strong impact caused the windshield and tires to fly out. Hope that driver is okay. A car collision at West Avenue and Chapman. Between a school bus and an RAV4, the collision was so severe that the front of the bus and the rear of the RAV4 were damaged. Everyone was shocked by the situation, but thankfully, no children were on the bus, and no one was injured. The haste of this driver was confirmed by the police, and his reward was a speeding ticket. The Toyota driver suddenly changed lanes without signaling, causing the pickup truck behind him to be unable to handle it and somersault at least three times in the air before stopping. The impact was quite strong, and the truck was completely damaged. Two people were taken to a local hospital, with minor injuries shortly afterwards. This woman changed lanes so abruptly that her car and a player's car collided causing significant damage to both vehicles. No one was injured in the incident, but she claimed she had used the brakes. Fortunately, Ad Playa's car had a dash cam, so he pursued a lawsuit and achieved justice. The road was slippery and limited by fog, causing this driver's 2000 Tacoma to lose control and crash into the slope next to it. The rear of the car immediately rotated. Luckily, no one else was around, and the truck seemed fine. The incident occurred in Austin when a Honda Accord driver failed to yield to a Toyota Prius at a green light. The Honda Accord driver was issued a ticket by the police after reviewing footage from the Prius's dash cam. You will be surprised by this one-of-a-kind moment. The tire from an SUV suddenly falls off and wanders on the highway. Switching from one lane to another without even touching a car. This young man decided to use the rim to save time instead of waiting for a tire replacement. It seems for him, 
time is more valuable than the value of a whole car. Perhaps this is why you should slow down a bit when everyone is stepping out. One should not trust someone when they passively move into one's lane. Holy sh In a half mile, take. Perhaps this huge truck is still not big enough in the eyes of some. This SUV seems to have forgotten the steps to be able to change lanes safely. I'm sorry. You're okay. I'm sorry. It's fine. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Are you okay? I'm fine. Did we make contact? No, we did not. Okay. You're good, go ahead. These drivers always bring us lessons. And if you want new lessons every day, please subscribe to the channel as a way to encourage us to create better quality videos for you. Perhaps no road is wide enough and safe enough for this driver. Oh, Jesus Christ. This motorcyclist used the brakes too quickly, so he suddenly flipped in the air before landing. Luckily, his equipment was quite safe, so he was not injured. Thank you for watching the video. Hope you have new lessons to make each of your trips safe. We'll see you again in the next video.